Good morning, explorers. Good morning. We're staying in our little Airbnb here in Mariana, Florida for the first part of our road trip. Yeah. So um, the reason why we picked this house, it's a little old and um, dated, but it has this beautiful view of the river. And there are like kayaks that the owners have in the back, we'll show you, um, that you can take like for free and go down the Chippewa River. Yeah. So um, let's go check this place out because uh, it's pretty cool I think. I think so too. Yeah. You can even swim in the river if you feel yeah, like Yeah, if you want. You don't even have to go to the springs. You can swim in the river if you want. All right, let's go check the place out. Um, there's kayak and there's two canoes. If you make your way down this way, I think we're going to go over this way though. <laughs> it's a little steep. It's a little steep, yeah. So one of the reasons why we believe that this thing is sitting on an old bridge is that if you look at the road here, it looks like it came all the way through and then went through where the house is now sitting. So this would have been continuous and I think if you look on the other side, the other part of the bridge looks like it would have connected to the older part of the road. Yeah. Alright, so come in here and I'll show you what's about. This is um, where you come in. This is your front door here. And then if you come around this corner, you have this whole outdoor area. And there's a little light at night so you can turn it on and see out here. But it's got this beautiful swing set. <laughs> We've already hung out here a couple times. Yeah, it's been lovely at night. And then this view, look at this view, you can't beat it. To go right down the Chippewa River. Yep. You just get to see the whole there. thing right there. Yeah. See, this is over here. That's and this what is what we believe. Connected. Was the other side of the bridge. We're gonna find out more, and we'll let you know. Yeah. But it looks really old. Whatever this is. <laughs> <laughs> but beautiful. And then if you come around over here, there's more chairs for seating. So you have lots of seating. You can have lots of people. A little girl. Yeah. It's not big, but it might take a while to cook. But if you have a small family, it works perfectly. Yeah, and then just break more of the porch. Yep. Let's take a look inside. You walk up two steps very easily. Come on in. As you can see, all the walls are made of wood. Floors are made of wood. We have two children sitting in the living room. <laughs> um, they have a nice comfy little sitting area and a TV. The best part is this painting over here. <laughs> it is very creepy. It creeped us out when we are walking in. We are like, I don't know if I want that thing staring at us when we sleep. Yes. Or watch TV even. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. No offense to the owner. <laughs> All right. And then if you come down this way, you see there's a double sized bed, a dresser, but this had stuff in it, so we weren't able to use it, and then a little desk. It's a lot of old furniture. Yes. But um, as far as dresser space goes, yeah, they already have the drawers filled with uh, linens and things. Yeah, not too much dresser space, but there is a closet. There is a closet. So if you bring some hangers, you can hang your stuff. And that's the bed. And the bed. Here, this is the kitchen. Nice scene for four. If you prefer to have one a person on each side of it, then you could slide it out a little bit. Yeah. But it was easier for us just to have it this way. And there's a refrigerator, microwave, a gas stove. Yeah, and we didn't blow up. 
Yeah, we didn't blow up. It's the first time I've used one in like 30 years. <laughs> <laughs> and toaster oven, so and you got everything you need for the, um, if Cooking. you're gonna make a meal or something like that. There is a back door to the porch. There's a lot of doors on this house. Mm -hmm. So, all right, let's go check this way. Um, the air conditioner here is great and I think it's new because it gets really cold here at night. Yeah. Yeah. It's funny. I don't know if there's like a transition. It runs colder during the day. At yeah. night I actually woke up sweating a couple times. Uh, okay. So then this is the bathroom. Standard bathroom. The master yeah. bedroom. Um, it does have air conditioner in it. Even though there's a wall unit, I think that they just had the air conditioner replaced. You got a little desk, another little desk. Excuse our camera equipment, we're kind of uh, all over the place. Yes, we have a It lot. takes a lot to do this. <laughs> and a bed, two, like a closet and another little closet. And then this actually is a door out to the outside again. So this is the master bedroom. It, like we said, it's nothing fancy, but if you want to come and like be out in the nature, this is a perfect spot. Yep, you get to stay on the river. Yep, and you get to stay on the river. Not too many people get to stay on that river. <sighs> okay. All right. Well, we talked to the owners. We found out all the information on this house. Yeah. It's a lot older than I thought it was. Oh, definitely. Yeah. yeah. So, so it appears that it's around 1950, circa yeah. 1950. That the house was actually moved here. This yeah. house was moved from another location. And we were right. It was uh, built on top of part of an old bridge, which yeah. is really cool kind of fun story yeah go ahead and tell them so the bridge itself used to be the old highway bridge now highway they, 90 yeah now okay. they have a you can see it on the side of the house um, but it was actually used or it existed during the uh, before war. the civil war actually yeah. so they had a big fight way down there that's why the bridge was destroyed pretty much during the civil war really interesting pretty historic huh yeah yeah and um, the house that the owners live in, it was actually pretty old too. Yeah, it was the same, about the, around the same time, 1950s, 1950. but uh, this house was actually owned by a druggist who had it moved from another location. So Yeah, yeah. so we're living in a house that was moved. <laughs> yeah, That's and where it's actually right in the middle of the old Highway 90. Yep, so, pretty really neat. neat. Um, I I think that's going to be it though for this video um, and this is uh, one of the Airbnbs there are going to be many so look for those videos mm -hmm. um, we had a great time here definitely and, you know the house is old and dated but it's historical so of course it's old and dated <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but um, I think that's going to be it thank you for coming along with us yep keep and, exploring yep and I, my turn now oh yeah <laughs> and we'll see you on the next one <laughs>